Papua New Guinea has continued to get uh, foreign direct investment. People are complaining that the foreign direct investment coming to South Africa is dwindling. Do you think that South Africa's administration could learn anything from the Papua New Guinea uh, lesson? Of or course. I went into Papua New Guinea for a week. I met the Prime Minister and about 50% of the cabinet. Now the Prime Minister is the leader of the country. Now I've got a, uh, I mean I'm, I'm not, um, what are we, a medium or small scale, you know, mining company, yet I got the ear of the Prime Minister. Um, and, and it wasn't with fanfare, it wasn't with entourage, it was sitting at a table, he had uh, two advisors with him, and that was it. I'm sure he probably had a car and a driver outside, but there were no, you know, there was no fanfare and so on. And we had a very constructive discussion, honest, down-to-earth discussion on where PNG is, what's the politics, how can he help us develop this project better. Can our investment climate improve? Yes. A lot of transparency, a lot of openness, a lot of honesty. That means your ministers, your department, I mean we went to see the Secretary of, of Mineral and, and Geohazards as it's called. Um, you know, very open discussion with her. Uh, you know, so these people are accessible. Our minds are a huge benefit to the country. Highlights for the quarter, a record operating profit, uh, 1.3 billion. It's uh, the highest ever revenue. Headline earnings per share increased by 217% to 95 cents per share. If we look at the future for Harmony, it's really got a good upside. Uh, we've uh, forecast for the 2012 year of 1.45 to 1.55 million ounces. Uh, the gold uh, cash costs coming down as we build up production in South Africa. Gold price and the gold price for this quarter so far, although we're only a month into it, is about 420,000 rand a kilogram. Employment, you know, where we feature on employment, you know, the knock on effect of, of employing 40,000 people is huge. Uh, the taxes we pay, and it's a case of, you know, um, creating a bit of transparency. And uh, what about this electronic system? Isn't that supposed to be transparent? Yeah, it's not as transparent as it should be. Our shares are still undervalued, and we have more value in our in our sort of uh, portfolio than, than the market gives us credit for. Our production is increasing. We're going and moving in the right direction in South Africa, so the portfolio is certainly worth more. Uh, Wafi Gopu is, is a tremendous asset, and uh, you know it is bigger now than when Grasberg started originally. So you know it's it's already showing what size it is. It's got grade, and Hidden Valley is is a good producer. You know it's going to be producing for us what 140,000 ounces a year. Um, at some very good cash costs and there's lots of exploration potential.